Hello, this is Commander Hot Pants here. I just want to show you a really, really quick fix for a problem that's really rampant in Mass Effect models. Um, first of all, an eye fix and a transparency fix, and they're just so simple to do and they'll make your entire life easier. So I'm going to take this Joker model and I'm going to make it a respectable working model. So as you can see when I loaded it up, not only is he transparent, you can see stuff right through him, he also doesn't have any eyes. Well, I mean, he has eyes, but when we go in here, he has no eye control. And this, I'm sure there's a way to get this to work. I've seen a couple things about um, rigging cameras with a view target, and that apparently works. But I can never figure it out, so I'm going to show you a really easy way to fix it. So we're going to open up this model in the Explorer. He's right here. I'm going to open up a crowbar. Oops, I was just testing to make sure it works. Um... I'm going to find this model in the decompiler. Joker. And I'm going to decompile it. I just have a desktop uh, folder called work in progress. I'm just going to decompile it to there. Decompile. Happy decompile. Go to the work in progress. I'm going to open the QC file. Oops, I don't have it set to default. Sorry about that. Um, and in here we have all of his little bits. Um, there's three lines of code that I'm going to add here, and I have them up and waiting right here. I have flex controller, eye range, up and down, and right and left. I'm going to take these two lines of code, and I'm just going to add them under all the other flex controllers. Oops. Boom. Done. And then I have two other lines of code. Sorry, this is four lines of code, not three. Anyway. Uh, this one is mostly opaque, and this one is ambient boost. We're going to take these, and we're just going to put these somewhere in the middle. Uh, there's usually a little place that has similar looking tags that I like to stick it in. Uh, here. I'm just going to stick it there. And I'm just going to save it. And then we're just going to recompile this model. Compiler for Source Filmmaker. I've been playing around. Boop, boop, boop. I'm playing around with a lot of Caden models lately, trying to get one that works. Let's compile it, and it should put everything exactly where it belongs. Just double check for errors. Everything looks like it's happy. Oops, I shouldn't have done that with Source Filmmaker open. Do as I say and not as I do. Let's reopen Source Filmmaker. So let's open up Joker again. And now when we see him, we can no longer see through him. And his eyes have full control. There you go, that's it. Model is fixed now. This went from a model that I could barely use to a model that is top notch. That's it. Thanks for watching.